Hey guys, welcome to Desk Logic. This is the 10th video of the playlist that I've created for you guys on Adobe Illustrator for iPad. If you haven't checked out the previous videos, I will put the links in the description. You can check them out. So without further ado, let's get started. So guys, in this video, we will discuss the import option. Uh, it's a very uh, helpful option that is added by Adobe in the toolbar section and if you can see it's right here if you tap on this image icon so when you tap on this icon you will be given some options from where you can import uh, the images and files to your project like the first option is the camera so when you tap on this camera uh, option the camera app of your iPad will open and you can take a real time image and you can import that image to your project right away. So it's really handy to create illustrations of real time images and other stuff. So the next option is the photos. Uh, if you tap on this option, the photos app on your iPad will open up and you can load any of the image that is uh, already saved in your photos app you can import it to your project the third option is the files if you tap on this option the files app on your iPad will open and you can load the file and images that are stored in your files app so the other option is like cloud documents. Uh, if you have uh, stored any documents, any image, any file in your Adobe Cloud, you can tap on this option and you can import those files to your project. And the last one is the libraries. If you have uh, configured the libraries, you can import files from the libraries as well. So guys, that's it for today. I hope you like this video. Please make sure you subscribe to the channel and I will see you in the next one.